So this is the air mattress, dorm air mattress, and there is a light, the red light on the low pressure on the pump. So I'll show you how to fix this issue. So what you do, connect the air mattress to the pump and put this thing, you know, uh, on, on the frame mode. and change the setting from alternating to static so it's, it will be same on tally air mattress as well just change the setting from alternating to the static and put it on uh, frame mode the highest uh, frame mode and and then wait the air mattress to be fully inflated so um, the mattress will mattress is fully inflated and I can see all the cells you know uh, is, is quite quite inflated and quite tight um, so what you can do now is just check for the puncture so So I can I can feel the air coming from here. Yeah, so this is the puncture, which is affecting the normal operation of this air mattress. Now, what I will do is I'll replace the cells of this mattress. So there is a button here. Undo this thing. There is a button here. Yeah. I undo this thing. So this is the cells that I'm going to replace with the puncture one. Okay, so <clears throat> so this is the puncture one. What I need to do, I need a Stanley knife. Cut it so I know which one to take it out take this clip up be careful when you is turning using the Stanley knife Just clip it in. I'm going to push for it. Do the button, and it's done. I'll just zip the mattress cover. So the mattress is fixed. So it's fully inflated. No low pressure light on the pump and yeah, thank you for watching the video.